And besides this, giving all diligence. It requires some diligence. And you might think, well, that's kind of contradictory to faith because, you know, faith is about just believing, right? But no, according to Hebrews 11, faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. And verse 6 says that it is impossible to please God without faith for he that for he that comes to God must first believe that he is and that he is a faithful rewarder of those that diligently seek him. So there's diligence in faith. In fact, I think faith is not a noun. Faith is actually a verb, but we'll talk about that later. For now, you have to be diligent, watchful. Uh, you know what you're supposed to be doing. Prayer. Uh, abound always in the work of the Lord. Uh, there's another verse that speaks about that and then that after that add faith you know and and to your faith add virtue and to virtue add knowledge make sure you always know what what is the will of god and what god wants uh, wants you to do and then to that add temperance uh, you know add to temperance patience to patience godliness so so then the answer to never falling is to ever rise you cannot fall if you're constantly rising and you can never, you know, you can never die if you're always growing. And then he says to godliness, add brotherly kindness and to that add charity. And then he says, for if you do these things, if these things be in you and abound, abundance, they make you that you shall neither be barren nor unfruitful in the knowledge of our Lord Jesus Christ. Isn't that beautiful? So if you do these things, you will not be unfruitful. In other words, you will be fruitful, which is the opposite of falling or even failing. And verse 9 actually testifies. It says, but if ye lack these things, you are blind. You cannot see afar off and you have forgotten that you are actually uh, washed and cleansed from your sins. So I hope that helps expand it. The whole Bible is dedicated to answer this very problem how can we be saved from our sins and we are saved through jesus christ and what he has done that's why we have faith there but once we have known that jesus christ died for us there's some diligence that needs to be involved because this is a real battle and if you're not diligent if you do not watch and pray you will definitely fall